let's do another fastener basic. Aaron, head markings. Today we're gonna to talk about the grade markings or the head markings on a hex head cap screw. Yeah, so we're gonna talk specifically about inch series. Okay. And those common grades, which we're covering in SAE, the Society of Automotive Engineers. Correct. The specification is J429. Yeah, I love to ask people, grade two, grade five, grade eight, where does that come from? It comes out of the automotive industry. It does. Yes, SAE. So, on a grade two, now these are your common grades. SAE does cover some other grades. So we're going to do the common ones, grade two, grade five, grade eight. On grade two, there is really no required grade marking. You will see the manufacturer's insignia. Yep, that's but a minimum requirement. Other, other than that, it's blank. So grade five, Aaron, what do we have? We will have three radial lines marked on the head of the screw. Correct. And then I love this one on grade eight. I ask this to engineers all the time in classes. And I'll go, what's the head marking on a grade eight? And it's universally, they'll say grade five. Well, I don't know why they get five, but it's wrong, isn't it? Right, it's actually six radial lines. It's six radial lines, exactly. So, grade two, none, grade five, three, and grade eight is six, okay? Metric system. Yep, that's a little bit different. That's ISO mm -hmm. 898. They did something kind of cool. So, what they did, is they came up with what they call property classes. Mm -hmm. And you'll see property class as an example, 8.8, 10.9, 12.9. Now, you know what that stands for? What does the eight stand for? The eight uh -huh. is the overall strength of that specific screw mm -hmm. being 800 megapascals. That's right, yeah. so 800 megapascals. So there it is, an eight. Now we have a 0.8, the 0.8 gives you the yield strength. So it's that 0.8 stands for 80% of the tensile, 800 megapascals, is your yield, 10.9. A thousand megapascals tensile, 0.9, 90% of that is yield. Yep. Then what do they do? They put exactly that on the head of the fastener. How intelligent is that? So that's pretty cool. So you can look at the head of a metric fastener and see the 8.8 .8 go 800 megapascals, 80% of that is my yield. So really easy to remember, excellent done on the metric system. So remember your grade markings and what they stand for is your strength and property class of the fastener.